right what's good y'all so i'm about to break down the sample right now uh, it's pretty big sample so i don't know how i'm gonna break it down but i'm gonna break it down somehow so let's get straight to it Alright, cool. So that's a little snippet of the sample. So it's kind of different from what I usually do. But yeah, let's get straight into the breakdown. I start off with this more felt inside of contact, the dusky preset. And I made this chord progression right here. I'm gonna just play the MIDI and you can just listen to it and try to figure it out. Here are the root notes and here's a little switch up, okay? That's the chord progression, that's the main chord progression throughout the whole sample. You know, they did just three chords with a little switch up right here in the second half. I really, really mess with this switch up right here. Anyways, after that, all the effects I added was a dial P effect track and an EQ taking out some of the highs. That's the effects I added. After that, I just browsed Analog Lab and I was just looking for some cool stuff to layer it with. And I found this Summer Breeze Lo-Fi Piano by the 44th Floor. I just copy pasted the MIDI in here without the root notes like without the bass notes down here so here's what it sounds like so here here's what they sound like together both the midis So yeah, like I said, that's the main chord progression throughout the whole sample up here. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna just do it like I usually do, A part, B part, up until the C, D part right here, and then we'll see. Anyways, so that's the first step right here for the sample. The next thing I did for the A part, or the next thing that's in the A part is this vocal right here. But I can't see anything from this mic. Okay, so it's this vocal right here. Okay, the vocal is from Nikola Nikolic, Nikolic, a clarity one shot kit. I found him on TikTok, bro. I kind of was, I was messing with his samples. Uh, I damned him. He, he saw, he sent me his pack. So and it's pretty fire. It's pretty cool pack. Anyway, so it's from his uh, one shot kit right here. It's inside of the vocals. It's one of these vocals right here. I forgot which one. And here's what it sounds like. I just chopped it up a little bit to make it more on tempo. So I just pitched it down one semitone and I time stretched it and chopped it up a little bit and now it sounds like this. So that's a cool little intro for the sample, I guess. Just some smooth chords with some with some R&B vocals, kind of. Anyway, so now let's go on to the B part where some stuff is actually happening. So I kept the same chord progression with the piano and the analog lab. And I threw in this perk loop right here from the same kit. Nothing crazy. After that, I made this little melody right here. And this is also from Nikolai's uh, one shot kit. It's a dominoes key right here. And I made, uh, and here's the pattern I made with it. I just freestyled something on the keys right here on my laptop. So this is what I came up with. And all I threw on this was a little delay tape with the 1-4 dotted, 1-8 dotted stereo thing. And it sounds like this. Yeah, cool. So now we got these three for the B part. After that, I went and grabbed this bass right here. 
uh, this base is from the one uh, this this bank right here this one shot kit right here and i went with the potillo rizzo base and the pattern is pretty simple it follows the root notes and at the end right here it bounces up one octave and then to the fifth of the chord so this is the chord it bounces up right here I like that little bass line. I, I feel like it's fitting pretty well with the sample. All right, cool. So after that, I made this another, probably the most simple pattern in the sample, but it's the, by far the most fire one. So just listen to this right here. Super fine when these comes in with, together with the rest of the sample, but I'm gonna just show you the pattern and the preset. So it's from the same uh, one shot kit. It's from the Potillo one shot kit right here. And here's the pattern. effects just a black hole reverb some eq taking out some of the high so it doesn't get like too in your face it's kind of like more in the background or whatever so yeah that was the last thing or yeah also like uh, dragged over some of the vocals right here i dragged over this vocal and this vocal right here over here so yeah now i'm gonna show you the b part of the sample <laughs> So that was the B part, a little bit more energetic than the first part. So now let's go on to the C part. So same chords, you know, nothing has changed there. The same per loop. I got rid of this uh, lead thing right here with this melody, brought back the bass, kept this laser thing or whatever. And I got these two new melodies right here. So I'll just play them together, I guess. So yeah, that's the new two melodies uh, together with these. Uh, I'm going to just show you the patterns and the presets. So the first preset. Damn, I really used hella one shots in this sample. Anyways, the first one shot is from the Nikolai Kid. Again, it's the 80s synth, I think. Yeah, in the synth section right here. Here's what it looks like. So first it looked like this. I don't know what I was doing really, but I didn't like this. I, I did export it like this. But after I exported it, I chopped it off right here at the end, you know, so there's not really the sliding weird thing going on anymore. I just cut it off right there. And after that, the second panel right here is from Analog Lab. This panel right here. So it's just four notes at the end of the fourth bar right here. So the processing on the synth was just a dial P, some EQs, another EQ. Let's do nothing. And then a fruity chorus, detuned preset. Let me show you uh, bypassed and activated. So here's the pattern, bypassed. Here's activated. Yeah, that's that for that little section. Let me show you play the whole section right now. So here's the whole new C section. so now it's the d part and i think this is the final section i'm gonna i'm gonna break down because all of the sounds in the next sections right here i've already used them this is the only like the last section with a new sound in it so as you can see right here everything is old i removed uh, this synth thing and i removed this other synth thing and i brought in another thing from nikolai's kit it's an accent this guitar accent right here this one right here in the accent section guitar rough c minor here's the original Nice. Here's what it sounds like after I imported it, pitched it down and stretched it. I like how it pans from left to right throughout the, the accent. Anyways, uh, I put it to, I uh, didn't do, yeah, I put it a little bit to mono because it was panning hella. So I just like try to narrow it a little bit more to the center. Anyways, so that's the only new thing right here. Next section, D section right here.
and yeah for the next sections everything is like already i've already shown you the patterns so i'm just gonna let it like go through and you can just like analyze the arrangements yourself like looking where the sounds come in where the sounds go out and whatever so yeah i'm not gonna talk throughout these four sections right here except for the last one it's just a vocal for the outro but yeah <laughs> So that's pretty much it for the video hope you enjoyed it uh it was kind of rushed um, i apologize for that man i feel like i could have gone a little bit more in depth into each sound right here but you know it is what it is for this time i'm gonna try to be more detailed next time but i appreciate you for watching leave a like comment and subscribe if you enjoyed it and yeah, yeah i think you can download this sample for free in the link in the description if you want to flip it but yeah appreciate y'all for watching i'm gonna catch y'all in the next video have a beautiful rest of your day peace